This video is about the selection sort algorithm, and we'll use Python for some examples. Now first, let's just look at this algorithm, work through a real-life problem of sorting these five cards. The algorithm uses two nested loops. The outer loop is represented by the red arrow, which will go through the first four elements. And for each element that the red arrow points at, the algorithm searches through the remaining cards and finds the smallest one, which will be pointed at by the green pen. Once the inner loop finishes, the algorithm checks the value pointed to by the green pen and the one pointed to by the red arrow and swaps them if appropriate. This goes again and again and again and after each time through the inner loop and the swap, if necessary, you'll know that the element pointed to by the red arrow is now in place for the sorted array. Once the algorithm has made sure that all of the first four cards are in place, we know that the fifth card is also in place, and the algorithm is finished. Now take a look at how this algorithm could be implemented in Python. You see the outer loop and the inner loop, and you see six variables in all. Two variables, i and cur, represent what you saw with the red arrow in my example before. The variables si and sm represent the green pen. In other words, the smallest value to the right of the red arrow. And the variables j and comp are used in order to find the smallest value and point the green pen or the value SI at the correct index. Now take a look at how this algorithm will sort through this array of four elements. I hope you found this video useful. Check out my other videos, and I hope to see you again. Happy coding!